Welcome back to more of my career mode. Three falls match. The first superstar to get two falls will win the match. And it's for the United States Championship. It's one of the hottest superstars in WWE, Buzz. I don't like how they didn't give you a chance to mess with your character before the match. Like, what if I want to do something special for the first pay per view? Well, I better have done it before that Battle Royal. There's been a lot of coverage on Buzz's falling out of Baron Blade, but special. less is known about Buzz's other mentor, his father. I do know, however, that Buzz has an old say voicemail from him that he uses as motivation before his matches. Zach, have you been snooping through people's phones again? No, Buzz told me about it, I swear. I love that. I love the, the commentary from my career mode and the showcase is actually pretty flying. I enjoy them. More than you'd probably think. Alright, that was dragging. I don't know why that was dragging. No trick to saying the word hallelujah, Cole. Introducing the challenger from Springfield, Illinois, weighing in at 203 pounds, the Omega. Introducing the champion from Toronto, Ontario, Canada, weighing in at 235 pounds, he is the United States Champion, Bobby Haru. Get ready for some WWE magic. Can you just say some WWE magic? Well executed drop Player kick. must get two out of three via ten falls. Alright. Man, why yes. does everybody got four reiterate. reversals? This is Buzz's first actual singles match in WWE and it's two out of three falls. He is in over his head. A, a huge challenge, no doubt, but you have to start somewhere. Come on, Robert. Seriously? Check out Bobby Roode's offense. Drop kick delivered with precision. Seriously? Are you kidding me? And the atomic Did he just hits. really do a bubba butt bomb? How did you miss? That is what makes me mad. Will you miss where well, you shouldn't have? Literally every single time it happened, it makes me want to restart the entire match. Oh, thank you for well, long talks. Guys, these superstars really do appear to be in peak physical condition here tonight, which isn't surprising considering what's on the line here in this championship match. 
Whoa, bruh. Bad move there. Seriously, are you kidding me? Of all the moves you could go idea. for, it was that one. Why not the drop kick? Okay, of all the taunts, you're going to do the stupid there. one. I got to agree with you, Michael. These superstars are in tremendous shape. And from what I understand, the champ has been hitting the gym are you kidding me? daily. Are you kidding me? Tonight. I heard the same thing, Saxton. Once in the morning, then again at night after the show. Which makes me wonder when the champ actually sleeps. If at all. Buzz into the cover. Oh, and the champ kicks out. Seriously, just do that one every time I want to do that. As we say in the training, guys, the monitor area in the locker room is likely sold out for this one, as there are plenty of superstars with a vested interest in the outcome of this match. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. I think this man needs business. That almost came out of nowhere. Almost. He connects with a beautiful moonsault to Byron's. His shoulders are down. This is a level of destruction no one was expecting. Showing off his vertical with that drop kick. Just a nice little Ray Ray taunt right there. Ain't, ain't no thing about it. Just go for the finisher already. I don't understand the delay. The object is to win the match, isn't it? Come on, let's go. Yeah, you're right. The object is to win the match. But I'm not going to win it. the match. He gets it with a reversal. Ah, if I can't pin him. As Corey continues to criticize the action in the ring, allow me to take the other side of the argument. The last thing any superstar wants to do is go for the finisher prematurely. No good can come of that. Yeah, you really want to wait for the exact right time. If you go for it and miss, that can be the momentum shift your opponent has been waiting for. That slam put him in a bad way, guys. Sure it did. Message delivered. Oh, boy, he is rolling. What does Buzz have in store? We're about to find out. He's inflicting some serious pain here. But he's running on fumes here. Does he have enough left in him to capitalize? Things just went from bad to worse for Bobby Roode. Guys, a lot of people are predicting him. What does Buzz have in store? We're up against the Centon. That's how you put an exclamation point on the end of a match, guys. Is it, is it real? Just, just go for cover. This one's over. Nicely done. Oh, Are you kidding me? Target. Bobby Roode setting it up. Hallelujah. He hits it. Bobby Roode brings everyone to their feet. Ha <laughs> me too. He's in complete control. <laughs> Freaking turn it. The champion retains. Oh, Buzz just barely got out of the way. That was so freaking stupid. Whoa, down he goes. How did he walk? That was impressive, Cole. He's going for it all. Just. Uh oh. No. My comeback is from the top. He's looking for the win. Real nicely done. I can't believe he's in this. Too early for that. Surprises him with that drop kick. Are you for real now? Hmm? This guy 
that can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with anybody. Why is he countering everything? Could you stop rolling out of the ring like a little biot? Oh boy, he is rolling. No, you idiot. These athletes seem to have tried everything in their playbook. Oh, there's more in their arsenal, I promise you that. I don't know what it is, but they'll find it. here guys what a coward he's trying to get himself counted out Cole this is what makes him one of the best in the business why oh, could you not business Back now inside the ring. How did you miss that grapple? Oh, both just barely got out of the way. Got the reversal. He's just playing classic offense here. His front kick connects. Oh boy, he is rolling. that can only be described as severe. All right, you That's know. what he was looking for, Michael. He's talking his opponent. No, you don't get a second reversal. What does Buzz have in store? Or that'll knock the air right out of you. History might be made here. Things just went from bad. Shoulders down. Two. Three. This singles match has come to an end. Oh, wow. wow, so close. Did not enjoy. But enjoyed. And here's another pick of the moves he saw in that match. I can watch highlights of that one all night long. One of the great WWE matches I've ever been able to watch. Oh yeah, when he countered that. Hope everybody at home set those DVRs Why is because that, that was a match you're going to want to watch again and again and again. Epic. Buzz has done it. Those He's are some really poor Bobby choices for uh... a... In WWE, it Highlights. even more impressive. Kind of he did it in his first singles match. This guy is the real deal. Yeah, look, it's certainly a huge accomplishment to win the U.S. title the way that he did. But now the real work begins, defending it. He just won the title. Let the man enjoy it for two minutes. Please, please and thank you. Okay. Nice. All right. When you kicked out, all the glorious DDT. Love all these replays.
Well, I gotta save this stuff, you know, for when I eventually make his, uh, video package for his entrance or whatever. I don't know. This seems like something you should do. Oh, that was an intense match. I think that was better than the Falls Counts Anywhere match, but in terms of like implementing story into the matches, nothing's beat that Falls Count Anywhere. I love the like three different cutscenes they added into that one match. I wish they could do that just a, a tiny bit more with the main roster match. The new United States Champion is here on SmackDown Live. From one champion to another, congrats on your win over Bobby Roode. Thanks. I mean, woo! Oh. Maybe you should leave that to me and my dad. We're scheduled to hear from the U.S. champ later on tonight. And hopefully we don't have to hear any more of his terrible woos. What, you don't want to hear my woes? My woe woos? Okay, just, just out of curiosity, too. Any new messages? Any? No, no new podcasts. No new messages. Wait, it says I have four on red. Oh. I never clicked on them. Oops. It's appropriate my finisher is called the end of days because if I get a shot at your U.S. title, you're going to lose it by the end of the day. That would mean an epic failure on my part, wouldn't it? Kind of like someone cashing in their money in the bank briefcase and not winning the title. Don't worry, I'm not going to pull Corbin. It's pretty funny. You talk a big game for someone who's won on who's won two matches that's two more uh, uh, that's two more matches than you've won lately I think you need a lesson in respect I'll look into that but right now I have to go out oh who's gonna teach me me that would you would make a good teacher because what's the saying those who can do those who can't are named Baron Corbin those who can do those who can't are named Baron I don't even understand that that's a Baron Blade saying right there. So is this going to be another backstage brawl? Ring four. Ring four. Remember that I know that's what I just did. I talked to Baron Core before Brian. So yeah, it is. We got a camera backstage, and it looks like this is going to head to blows. Yeah. Why? No more talk. I will not fall to your bastardizing bullshit game. His drop kick finds the mark, and we're on the way. Look at these two men. Excuse me. Excuse me. The time for talk is over. We'll find out who the best That's is. That's a little cheap right game. Now. I am so excited. This I can play cheap. Finally here. I can Clearly fight cheap. This is cheapness. Now that's the type of move that sends a message to an opponent. Now that hurts. That's the point. Ooh. No, pick it up. It's time to move up the ladder here at WWE. Kinda, yeah. Yeah, it is kinda. Can you just get up? Maybe walk over here a little bit? Oh, yeah, I said walk. This has to be it. Do you not know what the word walk means? You'll be feeling the effects of that for a while. Do you also not know how to use a reversal? The drop kick hits the target. Baron Corbin looking a little shaken here. I fully expect him to bounce yeah, back, could, though. This is the that. type of one-on-one -on -one atmosphere where he thrives. It 
it doesn't get any easier when you're backstage, and it looks like he's finding that out the tough way. You never want to count a competitor out, but things don't seem to be Did going in his favor here tonight. This kind of offense yeah. he's known for. That Boom! Is, make an impact. That's it. It's over. It's over. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? He just barely brushed my shoulder, and I fall all the way completely down. No, 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 no. You're going to let go of me. Continues to spill backstage. This guy can go toe to toe with anybody. Stop it. The damage has been done. Ugh. He'll be feeling the effects of that for a while. What does Baron Corbin need to do now? And at this point, Nothing. how much more does he have to give? This match is trending in a bad direction for him. He hits it, but brings everyone to their feet. There it is. Can you yeah, get up, please? Ending. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. Now that's how you make a statement. Why does he get to reverse everything? Oh, Buzz just barely got out of the way. The hell was that, dude? There it is, the Hurricane Rana. have suffered the same fate. There it is! What a hurricane! Okay. He's one of those guys that gets going and it's hard to stop. A ring okay. simply can't Hard strike, contain. not gonna do it. Are you kidding me? Two cool for him there. Bullshit! Great offense by Barrett Why? Cole. He's starting to sweat now. Well, he knew this was going to be a fight. Fuck into this you! One. Let's not get ahead of ourselves, Cole. This is just a little bump in the road for him here. Nothing to worry about. Sometimes when you're dominating your opponent as much as he's been doing in this match, you lose focus. That's likely what happened here. Unbelievable what a move. He hits it, Buzz brings everyone to their feet. That should do it. I don't understand. What were the highlights, if any? Oh, his counter. That... I'm going through the table. That one, his counter. Nice. Same thing. Uh, backstage bra, her corner through the table. Smackdown. Live. Hopefully that teaches Baron Corbin a good little lesson to stay away from me. Remember to talk to everyone at the hub since there's little I know. I just you know, just got done through that. But I guess now let's talk to one Daniel Bryan. You're certainly off to a hot start here on SmackDown with your U.S. title win over Bobby Roode. Is there anyone you'd like to defend your championship against first? Yeah, you just said it. I did? Anyone. 
I'm going to take on any and all challenges. Well, that makes my job easier. So is that all you You're have to say? To I did? Well, that makes my job Yeah, yeah, he did. I guess real quick. Let's come up here. I'll do some style points on screen. We'll hit you. Get through the announce table because I really want that. And you because I don't know what that is, but I guess I want it. Oh, apron suplex. Sure. With that, that's how we're going to end this episode. So, I hope you all have a great day. Remember, only you can be the best dude you can possibly be. If you liked the video, give a like, comment, if you like, be super special, awesome. That'd really amount. And ta-ta for now.